Welcome back, Connor, to YouTube's premier storyboarding channel, Ink and Grow Rich. It has been quite a bit of time since I've had the pleasure of sitting up here on my high horse and talking down to all you little people. I am a golden god! Boy, howdy, am I glad to be back. Right about now, for those of you who are familiar with my little chunk of YouTube real estate, might be noticing that my current setup is a bit underwhelming. Strange things are afoot at the Circle K. Well, that is because the Ink and Grow Rich YouTube studio, with all grown to love and admire, sadly, is now a thing of the past. You see, about six months ago, me and my wife came to our senses and realized that you have to be a damn fool to continue living in Los Angeles in this day and age. And so, like all good-hearted and adventurous Americans, we decided to pack our bags and join the ever-growing California exodus. Which then begs the obvious question, where are you going to go, handsome? After many sleepless nights of deliberation, followed by several months of exploration, we decided to settle down in the great and sunny state of Florida. The entire state has been open for business throughout the entire pandemic, has a beautiful climate, white sandy beaches with crystal blue water, and this little slice of heaven happens to have absolutely no state income tax. I mean, that alone is enough reason to move here. So we flew on down to Florida and had a realtor show us around to about a dozen or so different places. We didn't immediately find anything that we liked, but we continued working with the realtor remotely. So Hi, baby. That's awesome. A few months later, we settled on a beautiful 5,500 square foot home, which sits on an impressive eight acres of farmland in the very, very rural Mayaka City. And we got all of this for pretty much the same cost as the 3,500 square foot home that we had back in Santa Clarita, which only had a teeny tiny sliver of a backyard. Now, we've got six dogs and two daughters running around in our home, so that backyard situation is kind of a big deal for us. Once we settled on our new home, we immediately began planning our escape. Apparently, a global pandemic bringing the airlines to their knees and alarmingly close to the brink of bankruptcy still was not enough for them to agree to fly our six dogs across country. Please step aside, sir. Go figure. So, after selling our old house and hiring some movers to haul our stuff across country, we were forced to rent a 30-foot RV, pack the aforementioned six dogs and two kids into it, type paradise into Google Maps, and hit the skids, kids. Now, my wife absolutely refused to drive the RV, like literally not even one inch, which meant your favorite storyboard artist had to sit behind the wheel of that lumbering beast for 12 and take a few naps. Six days later, we crossed the border into Florida, changed our family name to Ponce de Leon, and then the ceremonially set good. fire to the RV. <laughs> Since moving into the house, we have bought two horses, two donkeys, two potbelly pigs, and then seven chickens. Five of those chickens were promptly eaten by our dogs, which forced us to replace them with yet another eight baby chicks. It didn't take a notion, Thomas, to realize that the pigs were next to the menu, so we decided to get rid of them while the getting was still good. And honestly, that's not even half of the craziness that we've been dealing with since we moved here. One of my dogs broke into my neighbor's yard and killed two lambs, a goat, and a duck. So we were forced to rehome her, pay $10,000 to have a new fence erected, and then went out and replaced it with yet another dog. Now there's mention of buying an alpaca and getting involved in beekeeping. That is totally not a joke. We're seriously in the market for an alpaca and some beekeeping gear. Everything that I just mentioned, combined with a 12-hour workday schedule, has made it impossible to shoot any recent videos. But, I'm happy to say, I feel like we've finally begun to settle into our new lives here in Florida. From this point forward, I should be able to start uploading again at a regular schedule. Until next time, this is Vinny Delay with Ink and Grow Rich.